Hi everyone, The Lone Wolf here and welcome to episode 3 of A Week in Red vs Blue. So before I get started, I halved the uh, audio settings for, um, for the voice in-game. So hopefully uh, the FC chatter and fleet chatter won't be as overwhelming as, uh, as it was in the previous two uh, episodes. I'm trying to find uh, the right audio settings uh, so that it's all uh, pretty much in sync, but it's not that easy to figure out figure it out because I'm recording my own audio on a separate uh, PC and so I'm just back from work and I'm uh, right here in Otella and in this episode I'm going to try to focus on a different concept of red versus blue uh, it's uh, they're called purple fleets and if you see right here in the fleet fi finder they actually have a purple fleet up with 22 members in Lycurie um, so these fleets are where red first and blue come together um, in order to fight third uh, parties that have declared war on either red or blue federation. Um, so yeah, these are the real uh, the real war uh, fleets, uh, so, so to speak. Uh, there aren't the same restrictions uh, like uh, frigates to cruisers or uh, no ECM modules in the mid slot. In these fleets you can fly whatever you want and the aim is really to push them back because these are real wars. Um, I've already been in one purple fleet before. We went and chased after a few war targets all the way to the Dixie. Uh, but unfortunately by the time we got there they had um, docked up in station and uh, there was uh, no sight of them. So, so uh, I have to say that's probably the... the biggest danger uh, when you're joining a purple fleet is that there's a much larger chance that you won't see any action in them since these are real wars and we're depending on a, on a third party that obviously wants to keep uh, keep their scores up as high as possible they're going to take even less risks than uh, either red or blue side when whenever they're having an event or whenever there are fleets of them out um, so uh, the fleets uh, you can easily find them in the fleet finder i mean it's uh, the first weekday i'm just online and right away there's a purple fleet available for me um in the chat uh in the chat uh, channels of the uh rvb there are actually quite a lot of them i, th I think almost 10 different chat channels um, i haven't really had time to go and check all of those out but uh, in the uh, in the announcements, uh, they can also set whether or not a purple status is on or off. Uh, I guess when it's uh, on, that means that uh, red and blue won't be shooting each other, but will be focusing all their efforts on uh, on other war targets. And in this case, it's still off, so there is a purple fleet uh, out, but red and blue members can still go out and uh, shoot each other. Um, now, from the previous fleet, uh, I have learned that you want to uh, war target hunting purple fix or oh, just purple um, that you want to change the name of your ship um, because of course since there are both red and blue members in that fleet um, uh, you'll want to be a bit careful and uh, just changing the, the ship name might might help a little bit So anyways, I'm going to try and join the fleet here and hopefully we'll be able to bring you some action I see you guys then And I'm back after spending an evening in the purple fleet But before I get started, there is one thing that I should uh, rectify um, I don't feel like making a new introduction uh, so the audio setting that I changed was actually the setting for my own microphone. So that's not really going to help. Uh, it turns out you can't change the receiving volume uh, in e-voice because it depends on the volume set by the person that is speaking. So yeah, it looks like I'll have to edit that manually uh, in the videos themselves. Uh, that's going to be a bit of extra work, but I'll try to make it more bearable. So unfortunately I have no big fight to report uh, because the war targets were not very numerous, only 4 or 5 guys. Um, but I do have 3 small stories that happened uh, that I think are worth uh, sharing with you. Uh, first of all there is a Demos skill. Um, I myself didn't get on it. Um, we were chasing the Demos around several systems. And so um, in, a f we, in a fleet of I think around 30 people at the time, 
um, we were spreading out over at different gates and different planets trying to cut off his uh, exit routes and in the end they managed to uh, catch him, the whole fleet went on him unfortunately I was one system out so I came in late but still a 230 million isk kill, uh, that was not bad uh, after that we have a pretty long uh, chase of a trasher um, I think it uh, does show uh, very nicely how Basically the whole uh, red versus blue pack uh, was chasing after this one target, uh, that was pretty nice to watch and we got the kill in the end. And then finally, um, one of the war targets decided to try and play with us uh, by uh, undocking in an extremely fast crusader, I, I think it was around uh, 6100 kilometers a second uh, without overheating and went up to like 8000 while overheating and it was almost impossible to catch but uh, we had one amazing tornado who uh, sniped him off from I don't know 200 kilometers something like that that was definitely a very amazing kill for the evening uh, all in all it was very good fun I'm going to let the rest of the footage go um, and uh, yeah I hope that this give, gives you guys a, an idea of what it's like in a purple fleet in red versus blue See you guys next time. Is there anybody near him? Hunting now. He went at zero. zero? Warped again. Like Curry 3 or Customs Office 3. Going Planet 50. Planet 100. Customs Office 0. Not the planet. Customs Office at 100. Make sure to watch his next move. It seems like most of us are at the wrong place. Either warp to planet 1 or Customs Office 1. Customs Office at 100. Planet 150. I'll last about 2 seconds against that destroyer though, so you'll have to be straight on Is it planet one? I think it's zero. He went back to it's three. Warped. Back to three. Going customs at a hundred. Planet fifty. Point nine. I think he's zero at three. Have you said? I'm not on him at the moment, someone else told Point. Check door, check door. He's got away from me. He's down. Too far away for the pod. Oh, Pod's gone, just... like Curry 3 okay. comes off it. My vigil's gonna get one to him. Uh, Real Indy's got a point on him, I think. Oh, long point, he's still going almost 6k. Don't let him cut you guys, don't die to him. Once you can get a scram on him, no one can go as fast as he can. I'm not sure. 
actually that cr Oh, no. Oh, he's he's dead. Dead. <laughs> Whoever did that, that's brilliant. Beautiful. Whoever can show me the, um, the kill mail for the killing blow for that, I'll give you some cash. I think like 20 minutes.